This is module one, continuing ratios and proportions. In this video, we will be solving um, a proportion word problem. So our example is, that should say example, not extra example. Um, our example is Miss Metcalf's car used eight gallons to travel 144 miles. How far can she travel on 20 gallons? So first I'm gonna identify um, some similar uh, things that I have. So I have eight gallons, that's how far um, my car used to drive. That's 144 miles. Um, then it wants to know how far can I travel on 20 gallons. So this is a similar unit. I'm going to identify we have 8 gallons. We want to see how far on 20 gallons. Um, and then it talks about miles. So this is the new one. Um, 144 miles. My car travels on 8 gallons. Then it wants to know how far can I travel on 20 gallons gallons. So how many miles on 20 gallons? And we don't know that yet. So first we need to set up our proportion. Um, we either want the similar units on top um, or the similar ones on the bottom. We need to match them up, right? So we have gallons and miles. I'm going to put gallons on top. So we want it to be gallons over miles. Equals gallons over miles. <laughs> okay, so I have 8 gallons over 144 miles, so I have my 8 over 144, and then equals, and we have 20 gallons, and we don't know how many miles. Um, so we're going to put our 20 gallons at the top. And then since we don't know how many miles, we're just going to put a variable, say x. Now we have a proportion set up. Um, so we want to solve for that x to find that miles that we're missing. So we're going to cross multiply through that equal sign. We're going to multiply whatever's on our top times whatever's on the bottom of the other ratio whatever's over bottom of the first one times whatever's on the top of the second ratio. So eight times X equals 144 times 20. So eight times X, we just have eight X here. 144 times 20, we get 2,880. We still want to get x alone, so we divide both sides by 8. Divide both sides by 8. And we get x equals... 360 and since it's a word problem we want to put the unit we're using so we found how many miles it takes for my car to travel on 20 gallons so we have 360 miles that's the missing unit
there's my answer. And that was solving proportion word problems.